Yo, what up, off the Tar fam? My name is Shlomi Kleiman, and I'm a Jewish teenager and a student in Yeshiva, which is Jewish school. I have been Jewish my whole life. I went off the dark for a little bit. That means I didn't really keep too many Jewish laws for, for a while, and now I'm starting to come back. My message to everybody is the following. These are some things that these are messages that I feel every person that is unfamiliar with Judaism should become familiar with because this is something that can help everybody out. The first message is that one, know that Judaism is a very unique religion, that it is the only religion that makes a claim that over 2 million people witnessed a godly revelation, the same godly revelation, and they all had the sense and all those descendants had the sense and are still alive today. Every other religion starts off with their one person or small group of people, and then it spreads across the years. Here in Judaism, it, the starting point of it was, it's impossible for it to be fabricated pretty much. That's one thing, that Judaism is absolutely true. Number two, something else that I wish everybody should know, especially if you're a Balchuva or somebody that's not too religious, don't worry too much about, you know, trying to fit in. Worry, focus on developing a really genuine love for the process of connecting to Hashem. Because Hashem is everywhere. This is, Hashem is not some mumbo jumbo thing. This is a real thing, a real thing. Is everywhere, and it's important that you, when you start off, you start off based on love. That's one of the most important things. You learn to love the religion. That means you don't jump into the water head first, go from zero to hundred. Start little by little, and develop a real emotional attachment to it. Another thing that's so important is learning to understand the actual language. This is something that I struggle with a lot, and it's definitely something that's in, uh, very much easier said than done. But if you can um, devote time to understanding your prayers, to understanding the language, and over the course of a couple of years, really learn to understand the language, that's like, it's a big step up from just reading books in non-Hebrew or non Russian Kurdish. Another thing that I believe every single person especially if you're a beginner to Judaism, should know is one of the most important, is that the religious sects, they tend to disagree. Religious people are not perfect people just because they're religious. They have the same struggles that me and you have. And the most important thing is for everybody, whether you're religious or non-religious, is to learn to develop a baseless love for your fellow people. Hillel, the great sage Hillel says that someone once came up to Hillel, the great sage, and asked him, teach me the entire Torah standing on one foot. So you know what Hillel said? This was one of the greatest sages of all of Jewish history. He responded, do not do unto thy fellow that which you do not want done to yourself. The rest is just commentary. So the main thing is very, very important to learn the laws of ethics and how to speak. Social conduct is very important in Judaism. I'm pretty sure there's a, there's a study, I'm fairly certain it was from Harvard, but I'm not sure, maybe from a different university. But I know that there's definitely a study that came out and they told up, they had this list of all these things on what people feel is the single most important factor in a person's happiness in his or her life. And you know, there's a bunch of different things listed on it. The most important thing in the study that came out, the single most important factor for a person's happiness is relationships, the quality of their relationships. So when you're Jewish, definitely work on developing a relationship with you and God. It's, it's, what, it's a big part of it. But the other half of it, it's literally half of it, is learning to develop social respect and good social relationships. Peace of the house, no arguments, peace in your family, Make sure you're loving everybody and you're working hard and you're staying positive. With that, I hope you gained something from this video. Peace out.